King James tells the story of two young men from different walks of life who meet over a love of basketball and LeBron James and we follow the development of their friendship over 12 years and the development of their of their fandom and fascination with LeBron and with the game. So the play definitely deals with male friendship and uh, sort of emotional vulnerability. This play really sort of looks at that and looks at how the love of sports uh, and the, the sort of emotional investment in sports often functions as an avenue and a vehicle for, for um, you know, men to express some of the things that they, that they maybe are not as comfortable expressing at face value in themselves. If I can jump into my own sports fandom or anything that I'm passionate about uh, and think about those highs and those moments where I'm all in, and there is blinders on to the rest of the world. The argument of who's the GOAT, you know, LeBron or Jordan. Or if I can go in on what's wrong in our country right now and what's going on with us personally, it gives us the, those arcs through our friendship. I know I, I have some friendships like that, you know. We don't sit around and talk about our feelings even, even when we're at our lowest or even when we're at our highest, but we're always there um, so it's always that question of, well, how close are we if we don't really talk about the things we're feeling and, and our thoughts? I think it's a very relevant and, and accurate depiction of male friendship. I think that's the fun of it. The game we are watching is the game of, of these two fans, and it's really exciting.